I was impressed with that move you pulled. Bang. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, it's me, it's G, it's Dublin D, the undefeated, undisputed YouTube champion. That's right, it's the Maverick, Mark Daniels, here in episode 138 of our Pokemon Mystery Dungeon DX Let's Play. And guys, if you missed last episode, you missed one hell of an episode. Because last episode we went to the Sinister Woods. And we had a Shiny Encounter. And we recruited that Shiny Encounter. Of course, we have recruited Shiny Ampharos. Pwned us at 383 out of 472 on our current living decks. Which, of course, includes all individual Pokemon in the game. And all 28 unknown, which we have completed. And... All 27 shiny Pokemon. So today that means we've reached our benchmark. And we're going after our next legendary Pokemon. Which will be Entei in the Fiery Field. But first I just want to do a quick uh, item management check here. Because we are going to need some items here. Uh, probably a couple more apples because it is a 30 floor dungeon. Um, Ethers and Elixirs were probably good on Ormberries. or more than good on TBH. Uh, Reviver Seeds were good on. Okay we got Invitors. Okay. We got everything we need, baby, so let's go ahead and just go straight into it. So let's take a look here. Fiery Field, baby. This is the last of the legendary dogs that we need. We also need a Charmander and a Combuskin. Um, do we already have Blaziken? I actually don't know. We might need to grab two uh, Combuskins. Let me just double check on that. Uh, we actually don't need Blaziken, we have a Blaziken, so... Alright, so we need that, uh, Charmeleon we have, and of course, Charizard, we already have as well. Not counting Honoka, our starter Charizard, but we have a separate Charizard already as well. Yeah, I believe that's all we need, unless there's Pokemon we run into that are, uh, fainted, or, um... What, was it, what are they called? Mystery Houses. I almost said Monster Houses, but that's not correct. Mystery Houses. Yeah, we should be good to go, so let's jump right into it. So we do have a bunch of missions to do as well. Now, we are max rank in our Explorer team, so like getting the XP is not really a big deal for us. However, items, you know, we, we like getting those items. They come in uh, very handy, especially the the gummies, the Reviver Seeds. Sometimes you get like Invine Orbs as rewards. Um, those are pretty much the main things I really want. I wouldn't mind, you know, a few cleanse orbs, I guess, just to just to make sure we have some, just in case things get sticky, literally. Um, but yeah. So, anyways, after we're done getting Entei, which we'll do in today's episode. There's no, oh, you know what? You know what I should do? Hold on. Fiery field mystery dungeon. Let me look and see what floor Charmander is on, because it's probably early on in the dungeon. Want to make sure we get that Charmander. I also want to make sure we get that Combuskin, so let me... So Charmander's are on floors 5 through 9. Combuskins are, are on floors 24 through 29, so that's good to know. Good to know. Okay. And what I was going to say is, after we get Entei, because we are going to get Entei in today's video. It's happening. Um, we will, of course, go after a couple more shiny Pokemon. How many shinies are we at now? Is it 12? I'll double check for it. I will go ahead and recruit the Numel since we do have Squad Up. And of course, if you're unfamiliar, Squad Up for every member in our party. Well, it increases our chance of recruiting Pokemon. It's pretty, uh, pretty awesome, right? All right, so shinies we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We have eleven, so it's close. We have eleven. Um, I'll list them off here in a second. Which ones we have? Um, let's see. Gyarados took them out. That's good. I mean, if we're going to have a, uh, a client, Gyarados is a pretty good one to have here since... What's that? Oh, a Ditto. I was confused for a minute. I was like, what the hell? I forgot Ditto was in this dungeon. But obviously Gyarados has type advantage against all these fire Pokemon, so it's actually, uh, a pretty handy client to have. Yeah, so we're going to keep on going here. So the shiny Pokemon we currently have, we have shiny Execute, Executor, Gyarados, Ditto, Ampharos, Azumarill, Sudowoodo, Wobbuffet, Shuckle Corsola, and Ambipom. Um, 
I'll go over the ones we're missing here in a second as well. Let's go rescue our client. Those, those, those hydro farms are doing some work. Some whole work. Alright. Oh my god, this Gyarados is going nuts over here, dude. Pretty annoying there. Reviver Seed? Totter Seed, eh. Oh, we gotta find the Chesto Berry. Okay, so let's find a Chesto Berry. I didn't look at our missions. Because usually, like, if they need items, they're usually on the, the floor. But, I mean, there's a chance that there isn't, I guess. So the Shinies we need, I'll go over a couple here. So we need Shiny Butterfree, Ninetales, Rapidash, and Electrode. There's more. I'll uh, give me some more off here in a second. All right, so there's a couple items up here. Oh, yep, there's the chest over here. Okay, perfect. All right, Yon Mega. So there's also Starmie and Magikarp, Dragonite, Hoot Hoot, Noctowl, Apom, Espeon, Spinda, Altaria, Zangoose, Metagross, and of course, Licky. Licky. So those are all the remaining uh, shiny Pokemon that we have to obtain. And we're going to get them all. It's just going to take us some time. Um, it's very, uh, as you guys know, very RNG reliant. Um, you know, it, it's, it's a lot of things that have to go right for it to happen. A lot of RNG elements. And, uh, but we're going to do it, man. We're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good. 11 out of 27 is not too bad. Not too bad at all. And as far as legendaries go, um, obviously we're getting Entei today. We still need Mewtwo. We need Celebi. Lugia. Uh, that's all the Gen 2 ones. And Gen 1. Let's see, Mewtwo, Lugia, Celebi. We need Jirachi and Deoxys. And I think that's it for legendaries. Another special encounter that we have to get is Kecleon. Because Kecleon's kind of a weird one. It's not like... I don't necessarily think it's difficult to get. Now, I don't know how it works in this game in particular. If it's different. But in Pokemon uh, Blue Rescue Team and Red Rescue Team... You had to uh, buy... Well, you had to get basically steal something from the Kecleon shop. Grab it and then refuse to pay for it. And then it spawns just tons of Kecleons on that floor until you leave. So, you have a chance, and it was a very small chance in Blue Rescue Team. I'm not sure what the chance is in uh, Mr. Dungeon DX here. And all the Kecleons, too, were also very high level. I think they're like level 100. So, they were pretty strong. I mean, we didn't have too much troubles getting one. And I would imagine that in uh, in this game, it, it won't be that different. But it is kind of a, a special encounter, though, right? Because it's unique uh, compared to all the other ones. I think that's pretty much it. Now, the thing about Jirachi and Celebi is they're very difficult to get because you have to get them in a 99 floor dungeon, which is already difficult enough because it's very time consuming. And you have to do it in a dungeon where you start over from, I think it might be level 5 in this game, but it was level 1 in Blue Rescue Team. Um, and you can't, like... I'm not sure, again, it could be different than Blue Rescue Team, but like in Blue Rescue Team, you couldn't bring in any items uh, for Celebi. For Drachi, you could, but you can't bring any items in. We need an apple here. Can't bring any items in for the Celebi one. So that one's going to be very difficult. You're, like, you want to talk about RNG, that is incredibly um, RNG reliant. I forgot to grab some apples. Hmm, that actually might be a problem. If we don't find any apples. But we might be alright. We'll see how things go. Uh, we can also start seeing Charmanders as well. I wasn't really paying attention if we've already seen one or not, if I'm being honest. Uh, there's Vulpix. Another Protein. Another Ditto. Alright. 
Vulpix again. Now let's move on to the next floor. We got a few floors that we can find Charmander in. I'm also going to find the particular box. Okay, there's Magby, which we don't need. Now Lugia will be pretty easy. It's in a, it's just in a 99 floor dungeon. But the dungeon itself shouldn't be too difficult. Um, same with Mewtwo. Now I'm not sure if uh, if you can recruit them on the first go around. Or if you have to come back and battle them again like you did in Blue Rescue Team. Again I haven't really looked. Like I don't try to look ahead on those things. Because you know. I try to. Try not to get spoiled too much on certain things. I mean, I know it's a weird thing, something as small as that, if we automatically recruit uh, Mewtwo or not. But, I, you know, I like to leave a little bit of excitement, right? Where it's like, I don't know, are we going to get it? Are, are we going to get it? You know, I, I kind of like to have a little bit of element of uh, surprise. Okay. So let me switch to Ren here real fast. Don't know if I can hit hit it with uh, with false swipe from there. So I'm gonna move down one more. Smoke screen's pretty annoying. There we go. And we got the Charmander. So at least one new Pokemon today. I mean, two. We're getting Entei. And really, we're gonna get Combuskin as well. I mean, we're gonna get the whole the whole the whole squad here. We can also turn our attacks back on. Oops. But anyways, the reason why I bring those Pokemon up is because the way we've been doing things is the way we're going to continue to do things. Where we kind of break apart like these special encounters with trying to recruit shiny Pokemon. So, obviously before we came here to Fiery Field to go after Entei, we recruited two shiny Pokemon. And I think that's the way we're going to keep going since we do need, what, 16 more? Uh... Let me, let me think for a minute. We'll grab Kulava just for the uh, the squad up. So how many legendaries did I list off? Was that four or five? Lugia, Mewtwo, Drachi Deoxys. We won't count Entei. So that's four. Plus Cacleon, that's five special encounters. Interesting. Because probably the last thing we'll end up doing is probably getting Celebi. But with them being so difficult, maybe we'll just do like... A couple like episodes worth of runs and if we just keep failing... Go back to shiny Pokemon and kind of go back and forth. Maybe that's what we'll end up doing. That seems like the right move, I think. That was just a fainted Pokemon, yeah. We're not worried about Slugma. Plus, we kind of need our, our, our apples at this point. Uh, we're kind of hurting. That's why I'm trying to rush a little bit here. That's an Omni. We already... Actually, it's an Omastar, it looks like. I'm going to double check... But I'm pretty sure we already have uh, both. We actually don't have either Omnite or Amistar. Interesting. So the question is, guys, do I risk using the apple here? Well, the answer is yes, because I said yes. Yeah, welcome aboard, partner. We have two apples and a grimy food left. Now, the grimy food will help you know what I can do as well I can switch between partners too um, to have two additional food uh, like food bars if you want to call it that I guess hunger bars probably in a more appropriate name for it but I can switch between like Rin and Hanamaru and get a whole nother full uh, hunger bar so if we have to we will 
And we might have to, because we're still 20 floors away, and we've already eaten one apple, so. Things aren't looking good, and I probably should have said no to the Omastar, but man, I can't pass up an opportunity for yet another new Pokemon. You know what I mean? Some heat waves. I'm not even sure if you can even find apples in this dungeon. I hope you can. I mean, we could find a mystery house as well. They usually give us a couple big apples. Can I pick those up, man? Oh, it's a freaking ditto. Of course it is. We could also run into a Kecleon shop. I mean, there's there's definitely options here. We could get lucky. We'll see how things go. I'm going to have to basically wait to eat food until we get to zero as well to kind of stretch it even further. Ekans. I honestly don't know if we have Ekans. We do. And we have Arbok already as well. Okay, I don't, I mean, I don't really remember recruiting Atkins, but obviously I did. Um, I mean, I'm not going to remember all the Pokemon that we recruit, but you usually have a good idea. Another freaking ditto. Alright, we're at seven. Let's go up first because there's two items there. Alright, let's go ahead. You know, we could actually stay hungry for a minute too. And then eat. I know it's going to be annoying to, to do, but... We could also we can also get KO'd as well, by the way, purposely, and then come back with the revive state. Oh, we're gonna be fine. I'm not worried about it. The more and more I think about it, I'm not worried about it at all. Our big eater belt. Let's go and eat that grimy food. Nice. All right, put our specs back on. All right, we're gonna grab that item. An orb, it's probably a ditto, I'm not worried about it. Alright, we're officially halfway through the dungeon. We'll be seeing Combuskins here in just a few floors or so. What is it, floor 24? Hit you the fire blast. Next floor. Okay, Whismer. I'm positive we have the entire Whismer family <laughs> evolution line. But let me just double check. Yeah, we're good. We have all three. Whismer, Loudred, and Exploud. I thought we did. But you never know. Always double check. Because I've been wrong before. <laughs> Alright, we're grabbing the grimy food. Gyarados is in trouble. Beating up Machoke. Alright, well Gyarados is in trouble over there. And I don't like it. Actually, Gyarados survived, man. Let's check this uh, room out. Good old Rabby Dash. Hit with that heat wave. Perfect. Seventeen. Okay, there's Ampharos. Kind of seed a stun seed. Okay. <laughs> you know, I was hoping it was a reviver seed. <laughs>
big old focus blast. Gerard us, you son of a gun. Yeah, we'll go after camera up. Actually, we might have a full party at this point. Who all do we have? No, not yet. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we have five now. Okay. Okay, so four is rumored orb. Could be a monster house north of us. I'll check it out. It's probably not though. That's not. Found the stairs though, so not a not a bad choice. Some more grimy food. Yeah, we'll be we'll be all right for sure. I'm not worried about it. Right, There's the rumored orb. Oh. It's fine, we're gonna take just a, just a hair, just a hair of damage, we'll be fine. And then we'll eat some grimy food once we get to these stairs. Alright, so, big eater belt. Grimy food. And that's why I waited to get to the stairs first. Alright. All right. Alright, I guess we're going up this way. I keep trying to, like, dealing with, like, large Pokemon is difficult. <laughs> I forget sometimes cause they, that they exist, because, like, we don't really use them. But you have to, like, you can't, like, move past them at all. It's kind of annoying. By the way, another Ekans, we're not interested in that. Alright. Let me double check the combustion, but I'm pretty sure it's floor 24. Uh, yeah, 24 through 29. There's a Cacleon shop. We'll check it out because there could be evolution crystals in there. Definitely need some of those. Sorry, Kolava, you don't quite make the cuts, my friend. Alright, so we're out of uh, heat waves, so we definitely want to use an ether on Honoka. And we should be good on uh, discharge for now, anyways. Alright, so there's our boy Cacleon. Yeah, we'll take that big apple.
feel like I should have said no. And recruited Kekla. I kind of wanted to save that for uh, a reward for after we recruit some shinies, but thing is, there's also no guarantee that we'll even find a Kecleon shop with the, with our, uh, whatever dungeon we do. But uh, I guess we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Actually, I actually have an idea. I have an idea. Once we get like Lugia and Mewtwo, what we'll do is, uh, I don't care about Mewtwo. What we'll do is we'll do like two shiny Pokemon, and then after that we'll do more shiny hunting. But anytime we run into a shop during that time period of uh, shiny hunting, we'll go after Kecleon. I think that's what we'll do. No, we're not. We're not doing that. Come on, bro. If Kalava is not gonna get, a, you know, a reviver seed, there's no way in hell that Mag or not Mag Cargo, <laughs> Numel's getting one. Ain't no way. I couldn't do it. It just wouldn't be right. Could be in the middle. Double flame burst, double fun. It's not looking like there's anything over here. Someone's hurt. Who is it? I think it's Ren. No, it's not. Freaking Gyarados, move it, man. Alright, now we should start being able to see Combuskins. Okay, there's Ghastly. And a Charmeleon. Speaking of Charmeleon. Oh my god. It's an army of Charmeleons. Could you imagine being out like on a Pokemon adventure? And you see like 20 Charmeleons. How excited would you be? Like that'd be incredible. Oh, there's Combuskin. <laughs> right Pokemon find it as well, just not me controlling. Oh, this is Gyarados' buddy. Can we get rid of this, this very large Gyarados? Nah, let's keep it rolling, baby. God dang it. That's my fault. Hold up. God. Okay. Thing is, I can't do much about Omnite, so I'm just going to take out the Combuskin with the Charizard. I hope for the best. No, nope, okay. It's fine. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see more. We'll see more. We got a few more floors. Alright, there's Gold Bat. Let's get to the Gold Bat. Although Hydro Pump's gonna be hard to work around, isn't it? Like, I'm literally gonna have to like do something like this. I hope this is Combuskin. It is. Should survive that? Yeah. Won't sur okay, that's fine. Double Fall Swipe, Double Fun, and no, uh, no dice. It's Charmeleon. All right, so let's rescue our buddy. Gosh darn it. So that's going to be four new Pokemon today, huh? 387. It's pretty good. We're, we're getting close to that 400 number, man. Really close. Another Combuskin. Okay, we need Rin. Oh. 
I just realized I didn't switch the attacks off. And literally, I stopped to uh, push start or to get to the menu, and uh, it's too late. It's alright. I can actually just turn our attacks off now. Like, it's not a big deal. It's like I need to use attacks for anything in particular. Okay, there's Combuskin. Gotta worry about the Earth Power. There it is. Does it survive? It survives. False swipe. Alright, no, uh, again, no dice. That's fine. 26. <laughs> Speaking of Combuskins, we, we have a client that's a Combuskin. Ironically enough. It is Combuskin, so let me swap to Rin. Double kick, please. False swipe, and there it is. Okay, so we got Combuskin. We got Charmander, we got Omastar, so that's three new Pokemon. And then as I've mentioned, as I burn my Rin, I'm a terrible trainer. And as I said, we'll get Entei, and there'll be four new Pokemon added to the Pokedex all together. And then it's back to the shiny hunting, boys. Which legendary should we go after next, though? Mewtwo or Lugia? Hmm. I think we might go for Mewtwo. In Western Cave. I think that's what we might do. Alright, so. 27. Got some sunny day going on. A lot of items on this uh, room. Nothing exciting though. Alright, 28. Feeling great. There's Zangoose. You know, funny thing about Zangoose is I remember uh, I was probably. I want to say preteen or a teenager. Somewhere in that age range. I think I was in. I want to say the sixth grade, right? And I've been graduating now for 11 years. I graduated in 2009 from high school. And uh, there was. Just to kind of give you an idea of how long ago this was. I was part of a, like a text based RPG for Pokemon. I used, to use, I used to do a lot of those, right? And I used to make my own as well. Um, and like f like pro boards and like free uh, forms basically and uh, this one that I play I forget the name of it now but they had like a baby Zangoose and a baby Saviper was it a baby Saviper? had to have been I remember the baby Zangoose and I remember like after like just wanting a baby Zangoose anytime they release new Pokemon because of that I'm pretty sure it's a baby Saviper as well. That they, that like, you know, they, they made the sprite for and stuff. Man, simpler times back then, man. Alright, I was gonna say I'm, I'm gonna save an apple, but eh. We have a bunch of them. Uh, we have a bunch of apples at home. We just uh, didn't bring any with us because we're dumb, but it worked out. Uh, we're going to stay. I would love to go on. Licky Licky. I think we have a normal Licky Licky already, but let me double check because I'm not sure. Yeah, we do. We still need the shiny one, though. We still need the shiny one. And, you know, great, you know... We, we got to see the stairs there as well, so that worked out pretty well, fortunately for us. Uh, yep. Yep. So here we go, guys. The legendary battle with Entei, the final of the legendary dogs that we need. What with that heat wave.
Dude, that did nothing to Rin, by the way. Crazy. Nice para. Good stuff. Good work. Earth power. Big ol' heat wave. Solid hydro pump. Bop. Double bop. Let's get it. Four new Pokemon today, guys. How exciting. Let me go ahead and edit this real quick. So we're at 387. And also, let me edit my Google Docs. So we got Entei, obviously. Wrapping up the legendary dogs. We got Omastar. Which is a great surprise of a pickup. We got Charmander. And of course, we got Combuskin. And out of pure, just just to double check something real quick, I'm gonna quickly check my legendaries and see which ones we have left. Make sure I didn't miss one, but I'm pretty confident I named them all off. It should be Mel, it should be Mewtwo, Celebi, Lugia, Deoxys, Jirachi. Let me just quickly double check. So looking at the Kanto decks, yeah, we just need Mewtwo. Looking at the Johto decks. Just Lugia and Celebi, so that's three. And now to the Hoenn decks. Jirachi and Deoxys, yeah, so we have six. Right? One, two. I'm at five. I was counting Kecleon. But like six special encounters. Special encounters. Okay, cool. Right on. Um... And as far as, like, Gen 4 Pokemon goes, guys, there's actually not many left for us to get. We need Roserade, uh, Mime Jr., Riolu, Lucario, Weavile, Leafeon, Porygon Z, and Sylveon. Pretty exciting. Alright, so there's Zentei. No nickname, because I think we didn't give any of the other two nicknames. And then uh, some items here from our chest that we opened. Not not many. Of course, we want to keep charming. I gotta make sure we uh, get the Pokemon we want here. Make sure I don't mess up. We've done that before. It was tragic. Omastar. Again, very excited to get Omastar because it's kind of just out of the blue, right? Didn't really expect to see Omastar in there. Camerupt, we do not want. Combuskin, we do want. As ugly as it is. <laughs> I hate Combuskin, man. If there's a Pokemon that comes close to the ugliness of Unfezin, it's Combuskin. It's not the best looking Pokemon. Alright, so of course we have a bunch of missions to turn in. Um, we'll also do some item management, which we desperately need to do. Definitely add some apples to our, item, uh, to our inventory. We'll check the bulletin board, and then we'll figure out what we're going to do for next episode, guys. As we continue our shiny Pokemon hunts. Uh, two more, and then we're going to do, I think we're going to do Western Cave, and we're going to go for Mewtwo. Now, again, I'm not sure if we have to beat it twice, so I think what we'll do... God damn, we have to get rid of Mighty Anna as well. Um, what I think we might do is, if we have to run it twice, we'll do it once as a reward for two shiny Pokemon. Get two more shiny Pokemon and actually recruit Mewtwo. Because we still have to get a lot of shiny Pokemon. And I kind of have to try to split it up so, in some way. So I think that's the plan. But again, I'm not sure. Because so far... Did we have to go back to fight Kyogre? Or did we get Kyogre automatically? I don't remember. But I think outside of like story bosses... I guess technically Mewtwo is part of a story... Like part of a, like a mission that we have to do. Um, I don't know. I don't know. But I think outside of like, you know, story by like Groudon and Rayquaza, the legendary birds, and I guess the legendary dogs because we had to use them to get to Ho-Oh, but, but Ho-Oh was an automatic recruitment, wasn't it? Pretty sure it was. Anywho, that's the plan. Same with Lugia. If we have to go in, I think it's, is it Silver Cave? What, where's Lugia lo uh, located? It's Silver something. It's Silver something, right? 
let's see, ch -ch 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 -ch. sky tower, blah blah blah, which cave, where's it at, when I see it I'll know, I'll know which one it is, when I see it I'll know which one it is, when I see it, I'll know which one it is, or will I? Or will I? It's not this one, is it? Silver Trench, that's it, right? Silver Trench. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, Silver Trench. I knew it was Silver something, but I couldn't I couldn't remember what it was. Okay. So just a little over forty minutes. That's not bad for a thirty floor dungeon. Not bad at all. We gotta get rid of this mighty Yenna. Because if I don't do it now, I'll definitely forget. Sorry, buddy. Don't just forge yourself on other people's teams, and you'll be <laughs> and you wouldn't have this problem, you know. Can we go by numerical order? Yeah, we can. That's that. This will be a great easy way to like look at our living decks. You guys can take a look at it now, I suppose. I mean, you can see that we're missing, you know, Bulbasaur's entire line. We're missing Metapod, but you guys can kind of see like what we're missing here, and take a look at what we got going on. I do like the sprites because it'll also show uh, shiny Pokemon as well. Um, execute, shiny, execute, executor, shiny, executor. Um, There's a lot of pages here, so this is going to take a little while, huh? Look at that shiny Ampharos. Shiny Sudowoodo. I'm so happy they added shiny Pokemon, all the unknowns. So some, of the, Most of them are one uh, level 100. Got the shiny Wobbuffet. Wobbuffet! Shiny Corsola. Now, part of me wishes, like, all the Pokemon would have been, uh... Would, would have had shiny options, but obviously it'd be very difficult to do. And it'd be very difficult to actually collect them all as well, so I guess I'm not too upset about that. We do have two trap inches, huh? What's up with that? I don't remember that. Let's go ahead and get rid of one. Sorry, friend. Honestly, don't remember getting that extra uh, trap inch. Alright, so where were we? We're in the, uh, we're in third gen. Oh, hold up. Shiny Ditto. I think Shiny Ditto looks remarkable. Oh yeah, this isn't by uh, number. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da. Well, we'll obviously take one more big look at this at the end as well. But I don't think I've ever really showed the uh, the progress like this since we've started this journey. Okay, we saw uh, Trap Inch. Trap Inch is a little bit further in the decks, right? Yeah, right here. Bum, 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 bum. Obviously, we have two Clamp Rolls because we're going to evolve one into uh, Goribus or Huntail, and we have to get one more. We'll be getting those at some point. The Regis, the Lotties. Of course, Kyogre, Groudon, and Rayquaza. And now here's the Gen 4, you got the shiny Ambipom. Glaceon, the best Pokemon of all time. But yeah, that's the uh, that's our Pokedex so far. Very exciting stuff. Let's take a look at the Kecleon shop. Vine Orbs? No. We got plenty of apples, not worried about that. This, all these can go. Ethers are fine. We'll get rid of one of these for now. We'll get rid of a couple of these. Reviver seeds, maybe we have a little too many of these. Get rid of these for now. Cleanse orbs. Yeah. That's good. Alright. 
so Great Canyon we don't need. Sinister Woods. Uh, we don't need. Mount Freeze. Wonderful Pond we don't need. Howling Forest we still need. Northwind Field we don't need. Pitfall Valley. I'm pretty sure we're good on all those. Stormy Sea we might need. I don't feel like looking actually. <laughs> I don't think we maybe we don't need it because I think look Green Sea Star me. We already got Corsola, which is the far off sea. I think that's it for water Pokemon. Anyways, guys, let's see what we're doing for next episode. Speaking of Grand Sea, we could do Grand Sea for next episode. We get Krabby, Kingler, Seedra, and of course attempt Shiny Star me. Um, we could go Solar Cave. We still need Shiny A Palm. We do have the Ambi Palm. Um, we don't need any other Pokemon there. We have the Frosty Forest, Spinda, Northern Range, we need Ninetales, Mount Thunder, we need Dragonite, Remains Island. I say, you know what, let's go to the Grand Sea next episode, and, uh, oops, what is going on here? Um, everything's messing up. Let's go to the Grand Sea next episode, we'll grab uh, Krabby, Kingler, Seedra, um, doesn't look like clam pearls there. That's fine. So yeah, we'll grab those three for sure. There might be some fainted Pokemon we might need. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I'm the Maverick, my Daniels. Being your farewell, peace and one love. Bye.